let's cook. <laughs> <laughs> let's cook, guys. Are you guys ready? I was yeah. going to bring a pot up here. I am here, so but... ready. I'm so ready. <laughs> <laughs> so we are all blind to this movie. We're watching Ratatouille today. <laughs> and we were talking about our favorite meals. That's right. <laughs> and we got really hungry. And then we That's almost left. To say that. I know. We we're like, well, maybe we should eat something before we okay, start bye. watching. Because oh we're going to be really God. hungry after this. So none of us have seen Ratatouille. Nope. And nope. I look forward to this because it has been requested a lot. And I'm glad it won our recent poll. So very cool. Thanks for That's voting great. for it, guys. Right, yes. <laughs> guys. So favorite dish. We were talking about it doesn't oh, have to be fancy. Gosh. It can be complicated. It can be easy. My favorite dish that I love making, not really dish, I guess, but I love making tacos. <laughs> and lately yeah. I've been making pasta in our Instapot because it comes out so juicy and good. What about you guys? What's your favorite thing to do? I always okay. like one Bake. pot meals. Mm -hmm. Making different things every time. But mm -hmm. combos. Are really good. Yes, combos. Those yes. are very tasty. For yes. sure. Excellent. And you're also saying meatloaf. You were yes, also like meatloaf, meatloaf yes. yeah. And she's very good at that because I've had a lot of other meatloaves that are kind of like, it just tastes like greasy meat and yours is just so mm -hmm. like fluffy yes. and good and I love it. It's perfect, crispy yes. She does outside. a lot of cooking, guys. Yes. A lot of so cooking. she did. She's taking a, a year off. <laughs> yeah. Man, many we don't years know why, but she many, is. <laughs> many years of cooking. Yes, <laughs> right. yeah. I know it must be hard for you too this year because, you know, you just love cooking for everyone. Oh, yeah. She's so used so to different. I, I have to. I have to really slim down in the cooking. So it's like, oh, I have to make it for right. father and I. And yeah. I have to say too, just in mm. general with the pandemic, that a lot of us have, of course, been buying from the grocery store. We haven't been eating out as much. Mm -hmm. And I feel bad for those companies, businesses that need that. And we love going out. But this year we've been, you know, staying home a lot. You and gotta taper back a little bit. Right. I do take out to support once the in a local while. restaurants once yeah, in a too. while, but mm -hmm. you know, it does get costly. This and is, it is fun. Yeah. I mean, you're home, you might also make yeah, you know, I always like that, yeah. a great time and open yeah. up those darn recipe books that you haven't used in years. That's what we've been doing <laughs> right. this year, which is That's good right. too. And it's really because fun. Yeah. Get you a know, of wine, you're good. You know what you're putting into your food. And takeout is good. Yes. And when you go to a nice restaurant, yes, you have like true ingredients and stuff. But a lot of times, yeah. like when you go for Richard, quick service that. and stuff, it's like not the it's healthiest that. thing. Yeah, no, and no, no. at least when you're cooking at home, you know exactly what you're cooking. And yes, I'm finding myself being a lot healthier this mm -hmm. year. Mm -hmm. And uh, cooking new dishes all the time. I like oh, the yeah. basic Baking stuff, but we need to do more complicated stuff. Yeah. That's right. Hey, you know what? Practice makes perfect. perfect. That means we have to do it more. And more. Bread. Oh, bread. <laughs> yes. And everyone, it's so good. Oh, it's good, oh, Kim. Yeah. Yes. And Kimmy, I didn't even ask you. Many so what's years. your favorite thing I to cook love to do, I love to make stir fries or a crock mm. pot stuff. I love the crock pot. Yeah, crock pots are good. Nicole and I, I miss Nicole so much. I miss you, Nicole, if you're watching. Nicole used to make this thing that she called a mishmash. And I was like, what is that? Her chicken mishmash, something like that. And it's pretty much like you use the crock pot and now I use the Instapot as well. And you just uh, slow cook chicken. You make like pulled yeah. chicken over time. Beans, I take all kinds of beans. I even take chickpeas and uh, black oh, beans, yeah. kidney beans, all kinds of beans. And um, then I take like some taco sauce because I can't help myself. So I kind of like make a taco dish again, yeah. but I just mix ca like vegetables in there and uh, just That's a lot right. of beans. See, it's like a one pot meal. And we, really? yeah. we had that over at your place. It was good. Yeah, it's, it's so tasty, good. isn't it? I love it so much. So that's it's one of my good. favorites. So thank you, Nicole, because she's the one who started doing that. You can get the best too. recipes from your friends. You it's can. one thing yes, to look at a book, do. but yes, when you go to like, you know, a potluck mm -hmm. or just a party and you, wow. And, it's, okay, it's my so friend good. Yes. Taste it too. Jill makes the best buffalo dip and she does pulled Whoa, chicken really? with cream oh, cheese man. and different cheeses and it's so freaking good and she just makes it spot on like the best buffalo yeah, chicken yeah. dip. It's like a meal in itself because she does nice chicken breast pulled uh, in there. It's so yeah, freaking yeah. good. I'm going to do it like I this. Gonna, oh my God. Like oh my God, I'm God. salivating. <laughs> but it's so good. Meal. I look forward to that. And the poor thing too, because she's such a sweetheart. Jokingly, like she loves doing things for people, but she feels obligated to make it every time anywhere she goes because people expect it Because now. she did too good of a job. Yeah. Oh, well, too bad. Just that's every your time I do it, just like your mac and cheese. Oh, and John's that's you know what and it's cheese. it's actually really easy to make too and i love how everyone loves that but it is comfort food it's, it's good. so good and i just take noodles my secret recipe 
and I just um, not that part, but I add <laughs> Greek yogurt, a ton of Greek, Greek yogurt, yogurt into it with done, Velveeta yeah. cheese and a few yeah, other cheeses, done. and everyone freaking loves it. It's not hard, but I just love it because I just made it up one day. And Can you make that? That was many years <laughs> I, ago. Yes, before my I like Greek yogurt was huge for people. It's yeah, better for you. It has Velveeta, yeah, but it's yeah. better than any other mac yeah, and cheese because nice. I take a whole tub of Chobani plain yogurt, the biggest one you can get, yeah. and I dump the whole thing in, and it's really good. It's super cheesy. It has a little bit of tang oh, yeah. to it, but it's so good that's that way. Good. Yeah, it love is it. Good. Now I want to make that. Yeah, I think that's yeah. John's thing. Mine's taco salad when I go to a party with my yeah, friends. I love, yeah, I have taco. to make I my loved, taco salad. Yeah, your taco salad's really good. I like that. It's I'm going to keep good. showing yeah. here. <laughs> Man, that. so now what are we doing after this, guys? <laughs> Trying to take over the world. Are we really hungry now? <laughs> I know. So Ratatouille, I do see a rat, and I feel weird saying that because I want to say a mouse because I feel like I'm insulting him by calling him a rat. We had rats in Philly where I went to college, oh, but um, so I think dirty, nasty, but I'm sure this rat's going to be really sweet. A and Disney he's rat? Not he's not going to be. Yeah, and he's looking no, at he's this person, really and he's holding a spoon, so he might want to He wants to be a chef. He's I don't want to be in the rat. Yeah, but he's more sophisticated, don't forget. Oh, he might be, huh? Oh, he just doesn't yeah, have the so. regular he's food for his family. He, he, yeah, I guess he's a chef. He might be, yeah, because he's holding the, the spoon and he's looking at he's looking at a like, chef, I think. Yeah, yeah, that yeah that he is. Is. Chef. Okay. the chef is feeding him. Oh yeah, yeah, so maybe, he's or he's trying. Well, that would be dark. Oh, but I was yeah, gonna say, or maybe he's like, "Yes, come here. You want to cook with me?" And then oh, he becomes yeah. a rat tattooey. No, oh, that'd be messed no. up. Because <laughs> just because it says rat tattooey doesn't yeah. mean that that's what it is. We know that rat tattooey is a famous dish in France, in Provence, and I've never had it before. I've never been there, and I'm sure it's amazing. And it's like a vegetable stew, and you can have it with a bunch of other stuff. I guess it's served as a side dish or something. It sounds really good. Yeah. No yes. rats involved. I wonder, <laughs> so I wonder if right. Walt Disney World in Epcot in France oh, has it. Next oh, time. Maybe. We next time. Next we time. Can. I know. I'm really hoping out. we can go soon because I missed that. Yeah. At some point, hopefully. Next year. It'll be really yeah, nice. Yeah, next year, yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, that would be actually really cool. I'm, I'm sure they do have it there because it's like yeah, perfect. It should, it should That's like a perfect yeah, way to go about it. We love going around the world where you can drink and you can eat around the world. Oh, yeah. Octoberfest. Octoberfest is great. I love it. Yeah. So I think we should get into this and see what it entails. And then we'll talk about yeah, it afterwards. Okay, hey, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I can't help it, but <laughs> let's cook, guys. Let's cook. <laughs> let's cook. <laughs> All right, Ratatouille. Gusto oh. is dead. <gasps> oh, oh, whoops. Whoa, no. Oh. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's extreme. Loner house. Holy up. crap. <laughs> God. Oh, oh no, and she died oh, because no, of you guys. The ceiling's gonna break. Crash. Oh! Crash down. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh! Oh, oh, oh. She's oh boy, she's still at it again. I'd be like, wow, look how smart they are. <laughs> All grown up, eh? You remember Renata? Gusto's old flame. <laughs> Renata, how is she? She died. Oh. Oh, that's uh, a sorry. No. No. No, this is terrible. He's oh, ruining this whole. We got to tell someone that he's not. Oh. oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Look, he's not hot. <laughs> oh, God. You might be part of the soup. Yeah. Things will calm down, then he can sneak away. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh okay, maybe not. Oh, what can he get? Oh. He's gonna taste it. It's gonna be. Oh amazing. no, he's gonna oh, get cooked. My guy. Ooh, oh my god. Oh. Oh no, he's gonna close. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Whoa. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, he did ruin it. Oh, I oh did. that yeah. sucks. Oh, he's putting some things. Oh, he's putting some herbs in there. He's like, ooh, I'm seduced by it. I want some. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, wow, look at that. Excellent. <laughs> Intuitive. <laughs> He's a gourmet rat. Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> Whoops. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Whoa. <gasps> Hey, they like the soup! <gasps> oh no! Oh my goodness! <laughs> okay, go. Oh. Let's do this thing! 
<laughs> um, where is he? Yeah, where is he? Right. Welcome to hell. Oh boy. Welcome to hell. Oh, I God. I have that Hell's kitchen. Hell. Ooh, ooh. Perfect. That's a perfect way to do really? it. Really? Yeah. Yes? No. Yeah. <laughs> Oops, smack. Should I? Easy. <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh god. Oh. Oh no. Oh, see what you Watch your finger. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's fun. That's different. Oh, that's Watch crazy. your fingers. How honored I am to be studying under such a... No. Ooh. I just oh. you don't know exactly who you are dealing with. Remember. I know it's a lot of pressure. Clear, yes. I will kill you. Oh. <laughs> I will kill oh, you. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's not, no pressure at all. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Hey, this you. Don't, he's gonna bite you. Oh, oh, yeah. Stop oh. me out. I miss going out. Oh, yeah. No. Uh oh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh right he's out loud. No. Oh, good. Oh, no, no. Oh, my okay. gosh. No, no, no. Yeah. You. Oh. Oh, he's gone. Ooh. Emmy! Emmy! Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh, good. Take a bite of this. No! No! Oh no, my god, a bite. I'm sorry. Slowly, mm. only think about it. Savor it. it. Mm -hmm. That's a nice. challenge. Everyone so can funny. have a lesson in that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's oh, right. a salt shaker. Oh my <laughs> god. I got something I want you to see. I'm gonna show you how your mother died. You know, oh my gosh. Ooh. Ooh. God, just on display. Oh. Look, <laughs> hey. No, don't be out in the open. Oh, wow. oh, watch out. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what, you really? can't tell me? I thought you thought that was different. Oh, she's gonna have all the different. <gasps> oh. I didn't have she to help. I would have followed your advice to the ends of the earth. Don't be so loud. I love you. Oh, oh, I love you. <gasps> oh, oh, my that was gosh. a huge confession. <laughs> I have this, oh, this tiny, gosh. uh, a little, little chef, little, little voice in my head. Yeah, oh, tiny yeah. chef who tells me what to do. <laughs> I mean, you want to know have, why I'm such a she's learner? You, you want to know why I'm oh, such she... a great cook? Oh. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Oh my gosh, he's gonna get it. It's working. Okay. Ooh la la. <laughs> now don't get distracted, eh? Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Wow. Excellent. Oh, wow. And she's so respectful yeah. to the recipe. Wow. Look at your oh, wow. yeah, nice pad. Oh, <laughs> I can't get any better. Nice. <laughs> oh. oh. He's so mm. evil looking. Look at his hands. <laughs> you are oh, look Monsieur out. Linguini. I will return tomorrow night with oh. high expectations. Pray and your money. don't disappoint me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm it? not your puppet. And you're not my <gasps> puppet. Uh oh, uh oh. Guy. Oh, look at that. Oh my <laughs> goodness. I've been selfish. You guys hungry? <laughs> Tell dad to bring the whole clan. No, you're gonna oh, destroy everything. No, you had a spat. Yes. You don't try to like, ruin oh, everything. Wow. A lot has changed in not very much time, you know? Oh, and suddenly everything. Stole. Oh my god. Oh. Very stole. You know, you've never failed me, and I should never forget. <gasps> oh, cause, look at his stomach. Oh my god, look at him. Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh, 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 no. Observe. No, wait. <gasps> Trap! Oh no, he's trapped. Oh, oh no! What do we do? Oh, oh it's gonna be oh, no. the. Oh my god! Yeah, it would die. Excellent. Yay. Yeah, I got out. <laughs> oh, oh no! Oh, oh god! Take it easy. Oh god! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh, boy. <laughs> Oh no! Oh wow! Ooh. Oh look, he's so brave! 
Yes. But this rat, he's the one behind these recipes. He's the cook. You with me? No. No, not everyone. No, it is a oh, really yeah, it's yeah. Rat's yeah, it's idea. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh god. Oh boy. Yeah. Anyone can cook. That's right. And you always believe in him. You tell us what to do, and we'll. Get Holy it crap! Done. They're gonna cook it. Oh my gosh! He did come. Whoopsie <laughs> Daisy. <laughs> Oh, that's Whoa. clearly gonna shut it down. No. <laughs> I faint. <laughs> we need someone to wait tables. Oh and god! Oh, okay. <laughs> <On> roller skates. <laughs> oh my god! Oh! <gasps> Don't Emil. Oh, so Don't okay. scream. Oh no. Oh god, kidnap! Oh, god. And he saw you! Oh, nice. <gasps> oh, 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 it that. brings it back to his yes. childhood. Childhood, yeah. Oh. <laughs> nice! Oh, oh, more. <laughs> oh, <laughs> 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 And who do I thank? Oh God! Oh, uh, right, huh? uh, What? At first, mm -hmm. Ego thinks it's a joke. Not everyone can become a great artist, but a great artist can come from anywhere. Nothing less than the finest chef in France. <laughs> I will be returning to oh, Crystal yeah. soon. <laughs> Is its unpredictability. <gasps> well, yeah, it makes sense though. Yeah, it is. yeah. And of course they ratted us out. Ah. The food. <laughs> oh look, he's there too. Yeah. It's time. Here we go. <laughs> oh my god. And he's just the waiter. Not just. But that's yeah. kind of cool. Oh my gosh, look at that. I love the setup. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's so pretty too, the lighting. Aw. Oh, where's my spoon? Oh, that, was, <laughs> that was good. That was very nice. Very that was good, beautifully yeah. done. Aww. That was really good. Aww. Uh, I love it when they do the ending credits like this. You have some animation. Like yes. Yeah, entertaining. It is good. So I don't know if there's a cutscene or not, so I will just mute it for now, even though I do enjoy the music greatly. Oh, so yeah. what did you guys think? That was good. I I really it. enjoyed it. I love the story. That's was great. I agree. Little chef, he was so good. I love how he called him little yes. chef. It wasn't yes. like my well, he did say friend a few times, but he friend didn't say this chef. rat, this past. He didn't have like a negative name. Not that rat is negative, but that's how a lot of people associate that, you know. Um, so know. little chef yeah. is such a sweet name because that's what that he wants to be. Yeah. He's small, so we know exactly what he's talking about and respectful. And yeah, he was a good chef, and he's really good. He is this very good. He's <laughs> very good, and it took Pretty a very different place. turn than what I thought because I knew it involved rats. Of course, we saw commercials yeah. a long time ago, and just the thumbnail, we saw a rat with the human. I really thought watching this that he was just going to be a helper all the way through. But he ended up being the main chef well, with his yes. family learning, too. So you could be more than what everyone says you are. You could be more than just That's a right. Rat. Anyone That's can be a chef. Anyone can anyone. be anyone can that motto. Yeah. That idea is so positive, and it goes to so many things. Like, if you want a career, you're not limited to, you know, you can't judge who you are, what your lifestyle is like. Like, you can be beyond how you're brought oh, up. That's right. And not just and that, like any challenges that you have. And Luguini is Gustav's son, so that's And that was fun. Yeah, that was actually yeah. a big twist. Did you guys expect something like that? He had a letter I in the did beginning. Not. I, did, I did not expect that. I, said, Whoa. I thought that was a big twist to have that. And I think that yeah. was pretty cool too, because um, right from the beginning with that letter, you know, I thought it was, oh, okay, well, he has his job now because of his mom asking for him to have one. But for the main chef, like how jealous he was, like I knew he was oh, going to be a troublemaker really, all the way yes. through. We saw that from the start. Mm -hmm. But I really thought that Laguini was going to be this ultimate chef and he was going to learn through Remy how to do everything properly. And he was going to be the ultimate guy to take over everything at the end. But yeah, so that a was surprise. a cool turn. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That, was, that, was a, that was a good yeah. twist. Mm -hmm. And I thought the head chef 
was just going to give the whole thing was going to be giving um, Linguini a run for his money. The rat was going to just help Linguini along. Yeah. With his love for the food and just give him food and have him help them. That's but funny. Yeah. It, you know, it's really a surprise. And yeah. the concept is so cool. Like, I love the idea of a rat because, of course, like yeah, yeah, restaurants yeah. and rats do not yeah, mix. Yeah, yeah. Right. That's I the actually, last thing you want in your kitchen. Last thing That's you want right. in your kitchen bacteria <laughs> and the rodents. Yeah, and all those rats. I <laughs> love animals. And growing up, I had a lot of hamsters and gerbils, never a rat, but I always loved rodents. Right. I really yeah. did. And of course, they can't be dirty. I'm not naive thinking like, oh, you know, because I am very clean. I'm actually quite crazy with that. <laughs> but I always, I loved them growing up. I had no yeah. fear of them. And living in the city for a while, you know, we'd have rats cross our paths, like huge freaking like bigger than cats or, you know, like fat rats. Yeah. Not that I wanted to see that, but I wasn't That's like right. super freaked out. Like I didn't want to be bit. And yeah. I was like, ooh, disease. But a lot of my other friends, and I totally understand why I would freak the heck out and scream and take yeah. off. And yeah. I'm like, it's all right. You know, I love the concept and how, you have these two opposites that you do not want together, yeah, right. working together. And he was a great chef. He was. He was. That was awesome. Guy, yeah. And he taught his family that you don't have to, you don't have to eat the bad stuff. You can put things together and don't, mm -hmm. if you have That's an abundance right, yeah. of food, make the best of it. Yeah. Right. I love that. that. Emil really, <laughs> Emil kind of got it. Yeah, he so. did. So I just saw the little yeah. animation of yeah, the rat falling. Yeah, so I got distracted. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but no, absolutely. And it was fun how he was showing his family like, oh, with his brother, like, take a bite of this. Now savor it. Don't inhale mm -hmm. it. And honestly, I was joking. <laughs> I savor food, but that's not always normal for people. Like we go, ooh, this is good. Yeah, oh, a lot of people just yes. inhale it well, and that's, don't enjoy it. That so that's a good lesson, too, for our younger people, right. for a lot of people who don't really appreciate it. So even though I do love savor food, it. like I really had a better appreciation for it watching this because then I'm like imagining when you know Remy's saying okay now take a bite close your eyes really savor this moment exactly. what does this taste like Ooh, sweet and he's explaining it and then take this bite now combine it and I was actually thinking that That's were you guys that doing right that too yes. yes good and, yes. and it is it's a good reminder yes. to do that don't just yes, take just... things for granted and just put it together just because Mm -hmm. You know, really try to experiment. That's and we, right. know, we all have the, all these seasonings in our cupboards and we don't I use always them. Do. Yeah. I and do. you know what I mean? Fun. Like, oh, yeah. You can Especially experiment. with cooking, um, of course, you can easily mess things up too. It's easier than baking, though, because baking, you really have to follow ingredients, oh, directions, yeah, stuff like that. Sure. But Scientific. you really have to have a talent for it because it is an art to really mm -hmm. understand what yes. flavors go together. Now, again, I love food, but I'm definitely, I'm an artist in a different way, but not with cooking. So I couldn't mm -hmm. just like, you know, basics, yes, but not just to make something complicated and just throw a lot of random mm -hmm. things together and say, oh, mm -hmm. well, this will go well with this and, you know, make something so different and so delicious and mm -hmm. cook it just right. But it really makes you think in this and it kind of motivates me to try something different and challenging yes, tonight. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I don't know so what I'll do, yeah. but <laughs> what will you guys do tonight after watching this movie? Because I wonder if it motivates you guys. That's right. Yeah, I know how to make some bread at least. You know, one thing that I really did enjoy too was Remy's family and how loving they were. And a lot of people could relate to that, I'm sure. Yeah, and they don't want definitely. the family going away. You're not supposed to be like a bird. You're supposed mm -hmm. to stay with us, stay with the clan. Right, and even yeah. though they were very true and stubborn about that they had good points to make too because even his father was showing him all these dead rats which i was oh, kind of yeah. surprised because i think this was rated g but you have all these dead rats no they're not people but children watching they see all these dead rats and they yeah. still like yeah, that kind of like right. bothered me a little like holy crap but yeah. Yeah. he was making a point that we are pests it, life is dangerous well, look at the Humans beginning scene dominate with everything the old lady shooting them up. Shooting, oh my yeah, gosh, she's shooting up everything, she's shooting the house up. wielding granny. Even though she destroyed she everything, sure rifles was. had big kickback, like we oh saw, and she was God. like, boom, 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 boom. I'm like, wow, she's tough, huh? Don't cross her path. <laughs> and then even outside, she was doing it too. <laughs> and in the kitchen with the cleaver. I know, ruined yeah. everything. So oh it's God. a dangerous life that they have. So I'm happy that 
after everything that happened, they were able to really see and appreciate, which I was kind of hoping it is a Disney movie, but I was like, wow, they really full circle see and understand and the father coming out and saying, you have guts and you are trying to change things up and not because you want to be a chef, but because you want to just be different and prove people wrong. So that whole idea was a lot of fun and emotional too. I thought it was very sweet, you know? It was good. My favorite moment, honestly, was at the end where Remy's in the middle of that little like alleyway and yes. his family's on one side and his uh, human is on the other side. He just like smiles and he parts ways with them to kind of go his own way, even mm-hmm. though he is part of that restaurant. But it just gave you that feeling like he's doing something different. So he's just taking a different path. Right, um, right. In that moment, you know, yes. he's starting something That's new. Right, yes. So and I wonder how many of his clan are looking at him and saying, boy, I wish I had the guts to do yeah, that. Like that. Yeah, yeah. and Whatever maybe because they're all had. helping now, they're maybe just, they yeah, yeah. Yeah, are doing that as well, which is pretty cool. But maybe they will also branch yeah. off into different yeah. restaurants or some other kind of field. Who Avenue. Knows? That's right. Maybe. That's right. But I love how the father and the brother are just smiling. They nod right when he was like, yeah. I mean, he didn't even say anything. And he's just like smiling at him. They're like, OK, we'll see you later. Kind of, you know, and they just go way so it's actually really sweet how they did that whole moment and i also liked it with the humans eating in their dining room and then the rats are eating in their little and they had a nice place it wasn't trashy yes so it was was away from everyone but it was above too it wasn't like they were in like under dwelling like dirty sewer garbage area area. so and it was pleasant too they actually had a whole setup with tables and i mean they had tables underground as well But it's sophisticated, more sophisticated. (laughs) And I love it because we saw families of rats. Because I saw like a grandma rat or something, a little baby rat, and yeah, and they're living the life now. (laughs) But you're right, Kim, because you actually mentioned that they're all probably working there. They're working for their food. Because I joked and said, well, how are they paying for it? Because they keep talking about stealing and you have a ton of rats there now. And you can't just depend on one rat to do everything because that's technically like you know, pro bono, like just you know, ripping someone off mm-hmm. and living. Right, right. right. That's right, Becca. Yeah. But they're, I guess they're working for it. So that's right. good. That's they're, a good message. They're not too. taking anymore. They're making. Mm-hmm. So they're getting. That's right. I was overthinking some things, but just in the basic way, it was well done where they kept making that statement. You can't steal. You have to work for it. And then you'll be rewarded because he was so hungry in the beginning. Like he went through this trauma. He barely got out alive. And then Remy's just so hungry. But his own conscience is telling him, don't eat yet. You will be rewarded later. He didn't say it exactly like that. but You know what I mean? And it was his own like uh, imagination saying that to him. But it was true. So I'm glad that was a good message to show like, okay, good good things come to those who wait and who work hard for it. And Mm -hmm. it did. Even though Laguini fed him later when he was in that closed cool. area. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And you know where all the food is. Or the produce was, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. And you can see how hungry Remy was. He gave him a piece of food because he needed something. He needed sustenance to keep going. Like, I felt like, oh, God, he's dropping. I get that feeling. But he still stole food because it wasn't his to give. So in that way, he was still stealing. But Mm -hmm. an overall idea, like um, they learned a lot that you have to work hard for it. So very cool. Yeah, Yeah, very good. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I liked it a lot. Even (laughs) though Gustav died early on, he was such an inspiration for Remy. He was yes, very, he was. yes, he was. And he, it was I mean, so he positive. Went through. Even Colette took it on and made it her own. Mm, I liked and her. She even yeah, stepped yeah, it up. Was she, yeah, was, she, she was fun. She was stepped fun, up. Yeah. I mean, she's the oh backbone of that kitchen. Mm-hmm. Oh, she I mean, sure the, I didn't, we didn't character. focus on the other, the sous chef and everything. We didn't yeah. focus on them, but mm-hmm. she was... That's what you need I to know. be in that in the kitchen. Definitely. Yeah, and I agree. She was amazing and she was tough and she worked hard to be where she is. And she's so passionate. She loves what she does. So yeah. even though she's aggressive, yeah, she does, yeah. like she knows what she's doing. She's a professional. It was really over the top, but it was great. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> I wouldn't want that in an atmosphere. Like that. <laughs> it's got to be so I, I have a friend who's um, a general manager of a five star restaurant, and it is unbelievable the do. clockwork that yeah. goes on with everybody and, you, and it's true mm-hmm. like the garbage boy isn't you know you don't call him garbage boy but i mean everyone is part of that kitchen just like just have said mm-hmm. no he's not a garbage boy he is part of the kitchen you kitchen, have to see yeah. him for what you know there could be potential in everybody yeah right, everyone yeah. has an intricate role in the kitchen Mm -hmm. and it's amazing too what we take for granted because a lot of you might know what goes 
behind the scenes in um, a kitchen. And I know basics, but this was cool to really see some inner workings because you know that the creators did a lot of research to really know what goes on to get it right. And Everyone has their position. But to know like sauces yes, and you have like yes. the head guide and you have the Sue and it's like you have to have all these people that direct. And I'm like, holy crap, it's like really involved. Appetizers. And, 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 you know, yeah, I've heard. Everything. I have friends that went to school Enjoy to be it. a chef and it's insane. Like it's so much it pressure. Is, like you, you really have, have to, to think, go in for the love of it and work hard. Yeah, and you have to know, okay, everything is a domino effect. If the vegetables aren't prepped, then, you know, everything and has everything. to be you know, timed. Right. And yeah. I like how you have all these talented chefs, all these talented cooks working together and using spices and whatnot. But then you have Remy going in and he's saying, no, no, don't use that. Don't use that. Because he's like the ultimate guy who knows more than That's everyone. Because right, yes. he has he like this special nose. talent. That's so right. he has the great <laughs> nose, which was fun. But I'm like, hey, because it makes the other guys look like they don't really make yeah, good. It's like it's a right, yeah, it's like I'm doing Because they actually do a good job. But he was trying to do something different all the time. So a few times yeah. I was like, oh, well, it's cool that he's taking charge. But at the same time, I'm like, it's kind and it seems like they You're don't confusing. know what they're doing. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. once if he's not there at that moment where they have to make it again and you know mm -hmm. it's not oh, it's yeah. not made precisely how it was before, they're not gonna remember what he you, you know. have to write it down. Oh, yeah, but exactly. Yeah, but <laughs> That's it's just the artist like, in him. <laughs> yeah, so I'm glad that he's so talented, but just like kind of showing them up every time, like, no, don't use that, use this. Every right. time yeah. I was kind yeah. of like, well, yeah. they do know <laughs> some things, but at the same time they were stating that they were using they were following recipes every single time so yes. he was trying to change okay. it up yeah. to make it different so that was fun but yeah so overall very good yeah, um i liked it a lot i enjoyed a lot That's of the characters <laughs> and honestly going in i love disney movies anyway so i knew i would enjoy it but i really didn't think i was going to like it that much i don't know why because again i like rodents but just thinking rat and cooking yeah, yeah, i couldn't <laughs> figure out like how they could make a story out of that. But I knew it was going to be fun. So it was very inventive. I love how Remy was using Linguini as a marionette. Like that was really funny okay, too. Like good. how original <laughs> that was that idea. Yeah, he had nowhere else to go but below and you can't yeah. work with that. Yeah, oh, I know. <laughs> and I like how they showed that too because he was thinking oh, of all God. things he could do. And <laughs> I'm like, oh yeah, that's gross. Don't do that. <laughs> and then of course it didn't work out right away. He had to figure it out in the kitchen getting And it was and good that he practiced in this apartment. Yes, and they practice. That's yes, right. part of that was then, good. Yeah. I love how like his hair, like when you would pull it, it wasn't like attached to his scalp. Sometimes it was. It wasn't just a like, yank. It looked like he got like super long, like a few more inches of hair when he would really pull him up. Oh, so they yeah, made him look more like a puppet. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, like more Very, pressure. Yeah, creative. Oh, yeah, more right. hair you take, it doesn't higher. hurt as yeah. much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Man, if that they can go far, like if they teach other rats to do that to other people, oh, it's like done, they can right. all have their own human to like work around <laughs> the kitchen. Right, right. Gosh. You know yeah. what I found interesting was Ego. Yes. He was English and they're having French food. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I thought that was kind of interesting because yeah. it was European, right. but... I don't know much yeah. about critics. Yeah, I know I they go all over, but French that is different. Yeah, would be over yeah. an English critic, but... Mm -hmm. yeah. I love how his design was so evil. Oh, he was yeah, so the, scary. Yeah, 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 and yeah, you, not that I disliked him a lot, but he just has that look where you automatically yeah. judge him. But how negative he was, and yes, he's a critic, and I yeah, love like what his article so at the end. That was perfect because he even explained that. Like, we thrive off being negative because they yes. expect the best and if you always have high expectations you're going to be disappointed sometimes but that's their that's job right. so the yeah, way he that's... worded the article at the end was perfect because i'm like how is he going to mention the rats although legally people should know but he <laughs> said it in such a poetic way saying that there is change and that's the hardest thing for a critic it's like when you introduce something new and you have to be mm -hmm. open-minded to it but they made it sound really nice but, I mean, in that whole article, he didn't say a rat. But then right afterwards, that's when the business closed because legally you can't have that. Yeah, so and they I'm had to let the health director get out of there. <laughs> so out. I'm happy they made a restaurant called Rat Tattooey. Um, I'm curious on how that works and how they, because they know that they're using rats, that they have rats working with them at this that's point. Right. So how does that actually pass legally? I don't know. I don't know. But yeah. erasing that idea, I thought it was very sweet. Love the animation. The music yeah. was so beautiful and romantic. It was. Again, it was like great. the romance. Oh, actually, I didn't talk about the romance, but with the romance yeah. part of it, oh, I'm glad yes. it wasn't a main focus, but it was sweet because for some reason I just didn't think, thinking rat cooking, I didn't think they were going to bring a romance 
romance into it, but they kept that subtle and yet fun, romantic enough where it wasn't yes. overwhelming. I or was take very over surprised that that would even come about. I didn't. No, I, didn't I, think, was I didn't think they were going to be. I didn't expect you know, that too. Like that. A couple no, in the end. I didn't yeah, because when um, they were starting to show signs, I just didn't expect it at all. Usually yeah, I do I kind of pair people up. I always do actually, right? And yeah. this time I just didn't expect <laughs> just... it until he said something. And then later I was kind of shocked when he just said, I love you. Cause I didn't feel like they spent enough time okay. together to really have that, but yeah, you know, the story along and I did like them together. So I thought that was sweet. I but too. I love yeah. how they show, okay, they're in Paris. Not that that's a thing, <laughs> but they're showing passion. And they had, when Remy was going through the walls and the ceiling yeah. and you yeah. look down and you see the couple and the freaking girl has a gun and she shoots oh, it yes. up. Yes. Oh, you wouldn't. <laughs> Dear Ben, oh, I love you. And they just make out and it's showing like the women are tough and passionate and don't mess with them. And it was just hilarious. Oh so even gosh, with yeah. um with his girlfriend, when she like first meets him and she stabs him with a knife, like right oh, through yeah. his oh. jacket. And he's like, oh, <laughs> we were already shown that, you know, you have um, aggressive women before shooting that guy. And that's right, right. And make out with about them. their emotions. That's so yeah, so that was right. kind of fun to see that. But yeah, so overall, very good movie. I really liked it. Was it. Good. I, I liked enjoyed it. it. I enjoyed it. I, mean, I was smiling a lot. Much, yeah. That's good. My stomach is going to start growling. I'm impressed it didn't growl throughout this movie because I just really want food now. I'm going to keep it's saying right. that. Definitely so. going to make a good meal tonight. I don't know what, but mm, yeah, I don't know I, either. I, something neither, comforting. Right. Like I need something warm and, sad, yeah, and warm not stuff. the same pasta tacos. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I will figure that out. I'm sure you guys will too. That's right, too. Yeah, yeah, you will. I'll do a chicken stir fry. I think that's mm-hmm. what I do. Anything, think like, everything and anything too. sounds good to me because I love everything. So, <laughs> anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please let us know what you thought of this movie because we really enjoyed it. It was very heartwarming too and mm-hmm. motivational. I, I loved it. That's right. Me too. I, I liked it a lot. So, it two spoons up yes. if I had that. Yes. That's right. Yes. I'll have a ladle. And don't have this guy cook for you, though, because that's not good. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe. Happy holidays. And we'll see yeah. you very Merry soon, Christmas. as always. Happy holidays. Bye, Bye. guys. <laughs>